Yo guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can fully optimize your CPU for a huge performance boost in Fortnite. I'm currently free building with these tweaks applied and my game feels super smooth. I have such high FPS and my latency just feels non-existent. So without wasting any time, let's get into the video. For the first tweak, you guys are going to want to head to my Discord server, I'll leave that link in the description. Once you're in here, head to the free tweak section and scroll all the way to the top and download this auto runs exe file. Once you've installed it, it'll look like this, just drag this onto your desktop. Then to open it, just right click, run it as an administrator. And in here, go through and disable everything you don't want opening up when your PC turns on. It's basically an advanced version of the task manager, startup apps. So go through and disable everything, like all of these WinRAR shell extensions, edge extensions, everything you don't need, OneDrive, just everything. Go through and disable it all. Once you've done that, you just need to exit off. You don't need to save anything and you also don't need to keep this if you don't want it. The next thing we're going to be doing is heading back to my Discord server and downloading this Bitsum Park Control right here. Once you click this link, you just need to click Download Park Control and open this up. Run through the setup and once it's open, it'll look something like this. For the parking and the frequency scaling on both sides, you just need to make sure they're turned off and then you click Apply. Make sure you select your power plan inside here and once you've done that, you can just click OK and you also don't need to keep this app on your PC. The next thing we're going to be doing is clicking the Windows key and typing in System Configuration. Clicking on this, head into Boot, making sure no GUI boot is ticked. Set your timeout in between 3 and 5 seconds. I like having mine at 3 as it makes my PC turn on quicker. Click Apply, head to Advanced Options, tick Number of Processors, drop this down and select the maximum number. Click OK, click Apply, click OK again and that is that tweet done. But before I go any further with this video, I want to let you guys know this video is sponsored by Risen Tweaks. Risen Tweaks is an optimization service that offers all of these different tweaks for super cheap prices. They have tons of positive reviews and they work really well. I use these extreme tweaks right here and I went from 200 FPS on a stock Windows all the way up to about 500. So I definitely recommend going and checking them out. And if you are purchasing them, make sure you use code RUFFY and you get 15% off any pack. But back to the video, the next thing we're going to be doing is typing in gaming and clicking on game bar settings, making sure you turn off game bar, heading down to game mode, making sure game mode is turned on, head into graphic settings, make sure you turn on hardware accelerator GPU scheduling, head down to browse right here, go to this PC, local disk C, program files, epic games, fortnite, fortnite game, binaries, win64, click fortnite, click add, click it here, click options and set this to high performance. Once you've done that, click save and we can move on to the next tweak. Now we're going to be clicking the windows key and typing in services, opening this up. Inside here I'll go through everything that you can disable to lower your processes and give you better CPU usage towards your game. So the first one will be BitLocker Drive Encryption Service. So to disable this, just double click, startup type, set it to disabled, click apply. And if the service status is running, make sure you stop and then you can apply and click OK again. Cellular time, make sure it's disabled. Diagnostic Execution Service is disabled. Geolocation Service, Internet Connection Sharing Service and IP Helper. Net.tcp Port Sharing Service and NetLogon. Parental controls, phone service, print spooler, sysmain, themes, wallet service. Then scroll to the bottom and disable all of these Xbox services as well. Once you've done that, you just need to exit off here. And we can move on to the next week. The next thing you want to do is when you're gaming, click this little arrow here and close everything inside here that you're not using. These use up a lot of resources on your PC. And when you're gaming, you don't want that many. So close all of the things that you can so your CPU can focus more on your game. Now the next thing we're going to be doing is clicking Windows I, head into System, go to About, clicking on Advanced System Settings, Performance Settings, click Adjust for Best Performance, then click Custom. In here, make sure you just take Smooth Edges of Screen Fonts, Show Thumbnails instead of Icons, and I like having Animate Windows when minimizing and maximizing. You don't need this one, but I prefer it. Once you've done that, click Apply, click OK, and we can move on to the last tweak. The last tweak can be done in game. So when you're in game, click Control Shift Escape, head to Details, scroll down to Fortnite, right click, set priority, make sure you set this to high. Once you've done that, click Set Affinity. It can also untick CPU zero, and this will boost your FPS even more. But that is going to be it for this video, guys. I do hope it helped you out. 
if it did make sure to drop a like and subscribe but thank you for watching and i'll see you all in the next video